<laughs> you want to walk today? No? In the UBs today. Yes! And here we are. What are we doing today, Mari? We are going to prototype. What is prototype? A store with a game. We're gonna go play Keymaster. Yeah! Let's go play. Can I get a venti ice cinnamon almond milk macchiato, please? But light on the caramel. What's your name? Bryson. Bryson. Yeah, thank you. You photographer? Uh, vlogging. <laughs> Which is why we have this fuzzy thing on top. Ah, okay, yeah. okay, okay. Bryson. Thank you. Thank you. Yay! Now it's going. Coffee. Coffee. There it is. No, they don't. Oh, they do. So sick. Oh, yeah, they're going to find them too now. Look. Oh shit. Are you guys actually selling your bear bricks or what? Or is it just decoration? Yeah, for now those are gonna be just the decoration. Mother. Yeah, we get a lot of people asking for them. Oh hell yeah, man, you should get them in. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure if he's ready to sell those yet. <laughs> he has a couple more at home too. Oh, uh, right on, right on. Damn, prototype stepping it up. <laughs> oh yeah, a lot of Supreme stuff. Oh, and Babe stuff. The 5950 Supreme, how much is that running? The blue. Oh, this is a new release, that's why. This just dropped recently, actually. You want me to wear this? <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> She's not gonna let me wear that. <laughs> Okay, so there's a height chest, and then what is this? A different one? Keymaster, height chest, two books. Look at the difference though. This is actually for 50 bucks. 50? Hey, that's still not that bad. Can you keep the black one on the side for me? Okay, yeah, for sure. I got you a fresh one. Sounds good, man. Appreciate that. This one definitely has a lot more heat in here. We got 750s on the top, beluga, copper, more coppers. No, it's not bad. However, five bucks a play versus two. Two. Should we play? Yeah. <laughs> we can play. Which one do you think is the best one in here? Um, the one in the middle. Yeah, it's the one in the middle. Oh shit. <laughs> uh, nice try. Okay, wait, now you'll see. Got this, man. If it doesn't even want to eat my dollar, it's telling me no. Yeah, so you gotta move sideways first and then you gotta get your up after. The up is a hard one though, because you gotta release, but. Mm. 
Nope. You missed it again. It's pretty tough. It's interesting, man. Because what you got to do is you got to get it high enough so that it like spins and it like pulls it back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last one. Good luck. Which one should we go for? I don't know. This one. Ooh, ah. Wow. <laughs> Just missed it. Wait, so what if you do get it in? Is it like automatic you win? So there's an explanation for why people lose so often in the key master stuff. And I'm not saying this because I took the L, multiple L's actually. It's because um, I've actually done the research for it before. And if you go to the websites where you can like actually purchase these key masters or rent them out, they tell you specifically in the instructions and stuff that you can kind of set up the machine so that it pays out, pays out, so gives the shoe after a certain amount of plays. So say you have shoes in there that are like, like the belugas that we were trying to get for $700 usually that's what it's going for. So what they do is they set up the play so it doesn't give a payout until it hits a certain standard. So maybe like $900. So after every like 900 attempts or $900 worth of attempts, then it'll give you uh, the opportunity to win the belugas. And what it does is like there's a little mechanical system in there I guess that it triggers it. So when you release the button, it can kind of release it at a slight delay or yeah a slight delay or it goes actually on point if you're already off so that you miss completely so i don't know that's how that goes but yeah you should do some research on it the key master can be profitable i mean if you can kind of time it so that's why i asked the counter guy after so when's the last time somebody won so the one on the left with the royals somebody won like a week and a half ago whereas the expensive one it hasn't it's been like a month and a half so you can kind of see from that timeline that the payouts make sense so that yeah they make money for themselves and i guess if you can catch it at the right time you can win a shoe but for the most part unless you're using a lot of money you're probably not going to win a key master but yeah that's how that goes pretty sad right i'm pretty sad because if it was a month and a half it was probably close to a payout if people are playing at least once or a couple times a day so it's okay uh, it's okay it's not okay.